You want to get an edge on turning back the clock with just a few pills? Who doesn't? Well, it's no longer science fiction, but science possibility, a potential breakthrough. As I found out firsthand, there may be a way to erase years, at least inside my body. Granted, it's down the road, but some scientists are wondering if a new pill I took might offer a very long life. It may not look like the fountain of youth, but inside this nondescript building, I'm about to become part of an exciting experiment, a kind of guinea pig. Dr. McCord, okay. I'm here at the University of Colorado in Denver to meet Dr. Joe McCord, a world-renowned scientist. This is a pretty exciting stuff you're finding, huh? It is. We're very excited about it. His latest research could very well unravel the mystery of aging itself. And as decades of experiments may have the potential of adding years to people's lives and possibly prevent chronic diseases like cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. It all centers around this small yellow pill, and for me, it begins with a blood test. Here, can you scoop? Yeah, there we go. It wouldn't be the first time I've given blood for this company. <laughs> they want to check my levels of something called T-bars, which is a rough indicator of a person's actual age. T-bars can identify a condition known as oxidative stress, a kind of measure of the wear and tear on our bodies. Oxidative stress, like the rusting of an engine, is not a good thing bad for the body leading to disease leading to disease and leading to malfunction and importantly leading to what we call aging it is a slow progression of increasing oxidative stress that's the main characteristic biochemically of the aging process the problem of aging begins with the very food we eat to give us energy as our cells burn that food they also release toxic chemicals those chemicals, you may know them as free radicals, react with all the components of our cells, literally bombarding them millions of times per second, damaging all our cells. The result? Oxidative stress. And we all have it. The body fights back with a system of defenses. It makes two antioxidant enzymes, catalase and SOD, whose job is to gobble up the free radicals before they can harm our cells. So doctor, how often do I take these? And so, here I go. With that swallow, I've just become part of a potentially landmark scientific experiment. Doesn't taste bad. <laughs> It's called protandum, and tests on both mice and humans have already shown that it revs up the manufacture of those good enzymes in our bodies. More enzymes, fewer free radicals to harm us. Right now, all we know is that this preparation decreases oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is not a disease, just like aging is not in itself a disease, but it's something that accompanies and is attached to, to many disease processes. So you can see the age-related... Normally, oxidative stress, measured by those T-bars, increases with age. But in Dr. McCord's tests, taking just one pill of protandum a day reversed that trend for everyone at every age, even for an 80-year-old. They all are reduced to the level of oxidative stress that one would expect, frankly, in a, in a newborn or a very young child. So just what's in this seemingly incredible pill? Well, actually, its roots are very humble. Protandum is a combination of five plant ingredients. Some you may know, green tea or turmeric, a spice used in Indian cooking. Others, with Thania somnifera and Silibum marianum, are more exotic. There's a huge human experience with each of these ingredients. Uh, they've been used often in traditional medicine in India and China and uh, many other cultures. In some cases, centuries and centuries. And so, ancient Eastern healing and modern Western medicine may soon be working together. High oxidative stress is associated with more than aging. It's been linked to hundreds of illnesses. It's at the very center of many diseases. Liver disease, diabetes, emphysema, asthma. Uh, uh, I've studied all of these, strokes, heart attacks. Even mental disease? Yes. Depression? Alzheimer's disease, depression. Dr. James Crapo with the National Jewish Medical Center in Denver is also researching protandum for the company. We make no claims about curing any disease or preventing any disease. Um, we hope that when enough studies are done, perhaps such claims might be able to be made in the future. 
clinical studies to assess protandum in both diabetes and heart disease should start in three to four months. But what about my progress? After nearly two weeks now, it's time to get my results. Dr. McCord calculates the numbers. The result, my level of oxidative stress has declined dramatically. 45%, that's, that's excellent. Just look at where I fall on the graph, before and after. Which, if extrapolated back, is, is the level you would see in a newborn baby. Would you suggest I keep taking this supplement? I would. Um, I can't guarantee it's going to extend your life. I can't guarantee it's going to uh, eliminate any diseases or cure any diseases. But we do know that oxidative stress is part of those disease processes. I don't want to wait until I'm 80 years old and find out that I should have taken it. The company that makes Protandum says its tests show the pill made from ingredients used for centuries is absolutely safe. But because it's being sold as a nutritional supplement and not a drug, Protandum does not need FDA approval for safety. Developed after 40 years of research and exclusively for Life Vantage, Protandum is a true scientific breakthrough in anti-aging. Protandum has been reported on ABC, NBC, and PBS, featured in the Wall Street Journal, and described in CNN Chief Medical Correspondent Dr. Sanjay Gupta's book, Chasing Life, The Quest for Immortality. Protandum's creator, Dr. Joe McCord, is a world-renowned scientist and a pioneer in free radical biology. Dr. McCord is the discoverer of the key anti-aging enzyme, superoxide dismutase. His role in the discovery is so significant, the enzyme is measured in McCord units. So it's very exciting and it's really quite an honor at this time to be working with a doctor like Dr. McCord. You know, the, the information that he has uh, put out is published in some of the most well-respected, scrutinized, peer-reviewed literature, like, for example, Free Radical Biology and Medicine, an incredibly powerful journal. But these articles and these studies that he has published really make it clear that uh, this is very, very powerful chemistry. For Dr. McCord's discovery of superoxide dismutase and his contributions in free radical biology, he was awarded the Elliott Crescent Medal. This medal is awarded to distinguished inventors and scientists, putting Dr. McCord in the same company as Pierre and Marie Curie, Alexander Graham Bell, Orville Wright, and Henry Ford. Dr. Joe McCord has devoted his life's work to the study of free radicals, their role in aging, and the many problems associated with aging. Our bodies are producing hundreds of millions of free radicals at, uh, at any given time. And the notion that we're going to put out that fire or quench that number of free radicals with a single capsule of, for example, vitamin E or vitamin C, uh, really, when you think about it, doesn't make much sense. Rather, the approach is to turn on the genes to make huge numbers of copies of, of antioxidant chemicals in our body. Things like catalase and superoxide dismutase and glutathione. Consumers spend billions every year on antioxidants in the form of food and supplements, hoping to reduce these free radicals. But antioxidants from these sources can only eliminate one free radical for every one antioxidant molecule you consume. Protandum is scientifically proven to slow cellular damage caused by free radicals. Taking one protandum one time per day for 30 days turns on these anti-aging enzymes in your body. Your own enzymes eliminate free radicals at a rate of one million to one. I think any other supplements that are designed to be antioxidant supplements uh, probably are no longer needed because Protandum solves that problem in a much more effective way. We found, as many other scientists had documented, that there is a progressive increase in T-bars in your blood the older you get. When these same people took Protandum for 30 days, the age-dependent increase in lipid peroxidation was completely eliminated. After Protandum, we could no longer distinguish the 80-year-old from the 20-year-old. Protandum is protected by three U.S. patents. Universities around the world continue to initiate and fund their own studies of Protandum and to evaluate how this anti-aging breakthrough can prevent and improve many of the hundreds of problems associated with aging. 
Many academic scientists at a number of universities have begun studying protandem because it represents a new tool. It represents a way of reducing oxidative stress that wasn't available before. There was, simply was not a good way of doing what protandem does. Protandem interacts with the DNA in your cells and causes the cells to make more of a set of genes called survival genes. The ingredients in protandem were actually selected because they are largely metabolized by the liver, which does not interfere with most prescription drugs, which are generally metabolized by the kidneys. So the general answer to that is yes, it is safe. The immediate benefits of protandem are within several days the biochemical markers of oxidative stress begin to decrease. And while these are immediate uh, improvements, you may not sense that these things are happening, just as you can't sense what your cholesterol level is, if it's high or low. Uh, but nonetheless, these uh, benefits start happening within days of taking protandem. The advantages to taking protandum in the long term are that it protects your body from the relentless progression of free radical damage as we age. Uh, the anti-aging aspect of protandum uh, is one that accumulates over time, so the longer you take it, the more protection uh, you will sustain. Missing a dose of protandum is not uh, a big problem. It takes about two weeks for the effects to go away. So if you miss it for two weeks, you're pretty much back to where you started from. We've got to have the hard science behind products that we recommend. And you know, unfortunately, there are a lot of products out on the market today that do not have uh, the science that they need. Protandum has the science that you can depend on.